One, irresponsibility. Boom. Two, erratic work history. Boom. Three, chaotic and un unfilling relationships that never become profound or lasting. Boom, 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 shaka laka. Five, chaotic sexually, <laughs> often with frigid and promiscuity combined. Boom, 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 boom. <sighs> Note to self, check dictionary for enuresis. It sounds like an insult. Enuresis, bitch. Engages in petty criminal acts and less wealthy. Let's put a few drops of the motherfucking boss. Leads a chaotic life in which something dreadful is always happening. Boom shakalaka. <laughs> hey, it's a just it's the Buckingham Rose show. She likes to be known as Buckingham Rose or Buck Wicked for short. You can call her Buckingham Wicked Rose or Buck Wicked Rose or Wicked Ham Rose. Who knows? Here it goes. Let's. What, what the fuck, man? Why isn't it starting? Okay, I'm doing a skincare video. It's, uh, it's an antioxidant by the ordinary. It's reverse etual. Sorry, it makes me... And ferulic acid, both have 3%. Water-free, high-potency, antioxidant formula. Let's read some of... Uh, Marsha M. Linehan, who is the leading lady for borderline and I think she has borderline too which feels really good to hear and this vitamin C has like little granules in it and it burns kind of and I freaking love it and boy does it brighten the skin I'm gonna show you after look at my skin right now and then after and I'm not gonna have makeup on I'm just gonna have eye cream and face cream on Borderline conditions, early definitions, and interrelationships. Stern, 1938. So this is like an old uh, symptom list. Putting on this like CO2 mask. One, narcissism. Simultaneous ideal idealization and contemptuous devaluation of the analyst as well as of other important persons earlier in life. Two, psychic bleeding? What? Okay, that bubble C2 hyaluronic acid mask is off. I'm just gonna blot my face. Three, inordinate hypersensitivity. Overreaction to mild criticism or rejection. So gross that it suggests paranoia, but falling short of outright Delusion. Put a few drops, put a few drops, put a few drops of the motherfucking boss. Four, psychic and body rigidity. A state of tension and stiffness of posture readily apparent to a casual observer. And I like to blot. Two, three, one, two, five. Negative therapeutic reaction. Certain inter interpretations by analysts meant to be helpful are experienced as discouraging or as manifestations of lack of love and appreciation. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Depression or rage outbursts may ensue at times. Suicidal gestures. Six, constitutional feeling of inferiority. Wow, it's a big one. Some exhibit melancholia, others infantile personality. Seven, masochism, often accompanied by severe depression. Okay, so now I'm gonna put on my ferulic acid. Eight, organic insecurity. Meaning like it's like they're, I guess that means baseline. Apparently a constant, a constitutional, 1938, stern. A constitutional inca incapacity to tolerate much stress. And I'm just going to put a little bit of dots here. Well, you know what? I do have a constitution, a constitutional incapacity to tolerate much stress, all right? Thanks, stern. Stern there. I'm really trying to do this blot thing that I'm learning on uh, Susan Yara, who is a, well, I guess a renowned YouTube, com like, skin lady. Nine, 
projective mechanisms, a strong tendency to externalize, at times carrying patients close to delusory ideation. Huh? Who really agrees with me when it comes to squealing. I love squealing. It sounds like a squealing. Like, I think of pigs when I think of squealing. 10. Difficulties in reality testing. Faulty empathic machinery in relation to others. Impaired capacity to fuse partial object representations. Blot, blot, blot of another person into appropriate and realistic perceptions of the whole person. That's really interesting and something I'd like to unpack. The thing is, is it's hard to, like, why do I have to blot the first thing that I put on my skin, right? I mean, it's the only thing that's on it. Let's get my vitamin C on and then read uh, about douche, Dutch, 1942. All right, so like four years later, what did they come up with?